So, wow, today's show is called How to Be Brave Enough to Succeed. How to be brave enough to succeed. Oh, here we go. Karen's helped me. I think it's called The Body Keeps the Score, Brain, Mind, and Body in the Healing of Trauma. Yeah. So trauma, oh my freaking God. Haven't we experienced enough of that in this lifetime? And I would say for me at the beginning of this show, I just really want you to know that you are not alone on this journey. You're only as alone as you allow yourself to be. And sometimes people say to me, well, I can't afford coaching. I can't afford mentorship. I can't afford to work with a success sorceress and spiritual mentor. And what I would like to say to that is every single person that's come to me to work with me, every single person, none of them were like, wow, I have, you know, $50,000 sitting around, Jennifer, can you help me? Nobody says that. Nobody. Mostly people are like, wow, you know, like I have a little bit of money. What can we do? Here's my big giant problem, my big fat lie that I'm dealing with. Or here's my giant problem. Can you help me find the big fat lie? And I love it. I freaking love it. I just love it. And I would say, you know, being part of a community, being a mentor, using all of my sorcery that I know is just such a huge pleasure for me. And so some questions that you can ask yourself is, am I ready to invite myself to the next level of development for me? Am I ready to invite myself into a place and space where I don't have to be the bravest person I know? I know, like, it's so crazy, you guys, just in in full transparency, I have had so many traumas, so many. I just joke, I'm like, wow, when I did my Earth University contract, and they said, you know, oh, here's the trauma section, the optional trauma upgrade, Uh, which of these traumas would you like to receive? I just clicked the select all button. That's all I did. I was like, okay, I will have all of the trauma. So basically everything that you can think of uh, that is a trauma, I may have received that and perceived that. And so you don't have to do that, but also you don't have to make it that, oh, well, I'm an injured person. So because I'm not an injured person, and you're not an injured person, the traumas that you have received in this lifetime may have been very, very designed, you may actually have chosen them in the pre life. And um, so this might be a little Chinese to you, but you do Chinese mixed with Russian and Greek. (laughs) But you do choose your life experiences here on earth, you do. And, um, you know, you also have a thing called the veil. So you're, you're never going to be, um, fully cognizant of what you chose, 